You are watching Tia and Dolls. Hello friends. I guess you remember this doll house? It should be familiar by now, considering the number of times we have used it in my projects. Today we are going to renovate this doll house. And by that, I mean... Yes taking off some things I might not be using the right tools here but hey I grab what I had in hand and it works this section here is where the bed is supposed to go the previous bed was too narrow in my liking so I got rid of it. Kids, if you want to do this at home, please seek help from your parents. I've been wanting to take this up for a, for a while now but this process is taking too long probably because of the tool I am using so you might need to choose the right tool for this okay guys the demolition the demolition work is done now I'm just going to clean everything up and start decorating our home this is some of the wallpaper I was able to find and we're going to choose from these so I love this one. It looks it looks like a stone. And I think I'm going to use this one in the kitchen. This is a matte finish. And this is I don't know if you can see a little bit of sparkles. This one which is pink. I want I wanted to uh stay away from pinks. Unfortunately, it's not possible. I have the matte version and I have the sparkly version. And in this area, we're going to use this leaves wallpaper. And I think it will be fantastic. So I'm almost done with the bedroom. I had this uh, green wallpaper. Uh, that I, in my opinion goes with the leaves wallpaper and I decided to put it use it in the bedroom now we're going to move on to the toilet the bedroom no the bathroom and here is the result I love it For the next step, we're going to move on to the, the, the kitchen. We're going to cover all the walls with this stone paper. As you can see, we are done with this process. I went off camera and I did the living room 
and I, I love this area by the window where you can place uh, plants or pictures I don't know uh, yeah so this is the overhaul house and I love it I really really love the result it, it, it feels realistic to me now move on to the decoration we're going to bring all the furniture and everything I'm going to start with the kitchen I have this kitchen set from Barbies I want to cover the pink side of with the same wallpaper we use on the walls so this is that's what we're going to do now and I love the backsplash on this kitchen it matches the blue cabinet and the blue floor then I'm going to bring in my favorite all-time kitchen set from Bavi as well I'm just going to use two parts of the set I'm going to add this blue pot this uh, board chopping board with a knife and some vegetable a glove kitchen glove a kitchen egg and a mixer and for a fi final touch I'm going to add this bread little basket and that's it guys I want this area to be very light now, now let's move on to the living room I really don't like the, the rug on the floor and I have this beautiful fabric that I feel will uh, bring down all these flashy colors and it will give me a, give me a coastal style living room And then I'm going to bring in my favorite chairs, my favorite sofa. I did it by myself. It's very realistic. It, anyway, it's a white sofa. It goes well into the core. Unfortunately, I don't have any round table. The only thing I had is this uh, glass looking like oval table. And on top, I'm going to place a kitchen book and a teapot for decoration. And that will be it for this living room. Then I'm going to add, I mean, our room needs some color, some green greenery. I decide to bring in this tree and I will place it behind this window. That way you can look at it from inside and it's looking good. I love it. this uh, side table and on top I'm just going to add a, a phone and a plant have this bed also from Barbie the only thing I don't like is that cover is too colorful for this area so we're going to bring in our own cover and have this lemon yellow color I feel like it goes well in this area it brings out all the, the green colors
these two white pillars. I needed a side table. Unfortunately, this is the only side table I have and it's being I wish it wasn't. And then we're going to bring in our TV, our girl. Might need to watch TV sometimes. And lastly, a chair where she can sit comfortably and relax and watch her TV. Okay, the next step is just to decorate the little little shelf on the wall. I'm just going to add a few elements. And then I have this little bag from LOL though. One is also my favorite. I decided to bring it in on this set because of the bag cover. Now for the last space, which is the bathroom. I wanted to use a tub in this area, but I figured out it will take too much space. Therefore, we have to bring in a shower. We're going to place, place it here, unfortunately, on, in front of the window. And then we have this beautiful bathroom sink with the toilet paper included. It's unique, I mean. Then we're going to bring in our toilet, few uh, items like a shower gel, toothpaste and toothbrush. I plan to, to place here a round mirror. The shape of the mirror is very important because we don't have a lot of space here. So a round mirror would be perfect for this space. And uh, that's it. Uh, tell me, you guys, what you think about this de decoration? I had a blast doing this little project, and I love the result. I wish it can, it can stay like this. I want to film different scenes in these settings. I think the living room is my favorite place. The bedroom is my favorite place too. And then comes the kitchen. Uh, and lastly, the bathroom. So thank you. Thank you very much for watching this video. And hopefully I will see you next time. Bye.